an interesting question. Yes. Who was your role model growing up? Well, I had a teacher, a public school teacher, uh -huh. and her name's Pat Maravell. Tell Sorry, Jean. Pat Maravell, and I um, have a school that I opened for underprivileged kids in New York City named after her, the Maravell Art Center. And um, in seventh grade, you went from elementary school to a four elementary schools combined in junior high. So not everyone knew my mother had died. And there was an English teacher and he kept saying, Roseanne, do you have your homework? I'm going to call your mother. And I kind of froze and, and uh, he kept pushing it. And he didn't know, the poor guy. And I ran away from school and I was hiding in oh, the woods. Wow. And the police, my brother was in the police car going, Roseanne, come out of the woods. You are not in trouble. But I stayed there because I was scared. And this teacher found out. She was 27 years old, it was a public school, and she asked that I be her aide in ninth period. Mm. And she chipped away at the ice around my heart uh. until she finally got in. And sadly, she died about five years ago. And, um, and you were in touch with her? Oh yeah, I was oh. a part of her family. I mean, oh. I was on her children's godmother, I was oh. at every event, I sat in the front row with the family. And when she uh, died and she was, li I was lucky in that I had the resources to have her have home care for the last three years of her oh, life, that's right? Great. Which extended her life. And as I was leaving the last time, you know, she said, come here, and she held my face and she said, I want to look at you. And uh, I said to her, I'll take care of those two kids you pushed out. And she looked at me and said, um, you were my most difficult child. <laughs> because I was, I was so broken, and she was oh. the first person to hug me. Oh. She was the first person to say, I love you, to me. <laughs> no.